Apocalyptic huge eruption of the Shivelosh volcano in the Kamchatka far east of the Russian Federation. This is the images from today. This is the eruption of the Shivelosh volcano, stratovolcano, which was capped by a very felsic uh, um, volcanic dome. And now we have a huge explosion of this volcano, almost very similar to what we saw in 1981 in the St. Helens volcano in the Washington states of the United States of America. As you can see, the ash cloud has risen to 22 kilometers. This is the latest estimate. And it is spreading widely because the direction of the wind is actually not much, uh, you know, in the, in the way of dispersing it. It just stays in one area over the Kamchatka. People are making fun with the ash. Ash has fallen actually on the snow and it has covered it, as you can see, the already uh, snow-covered landscape. It's, it's very eerie and uh, scary in a way. Uh, people try to make the best of it. Some of them actually had done that sculpture, as you can see. And one of them now, you will see, comes here and just makes a... We have a snowman. This is practically not a snowman. This is the ash man, as you can see here. And it puts a date under it, so you will be sure that this is today. Let's see. I've already told you what is it about, but anyway, it's nice to look at it. As you can see, the snow also exists. There's a white bit, and they're collecting some some ash just for sample to give to the scientists. Yeah, 11th, that's the date of today. And we have another date also to prove that, and that is this one, 11th of the April 23. And in some areas, it is around, uh, yeah, 9 centimeters. And when the scientists collect it, as you can see, it's on top of the snow. We have up to 11 or 10 and a half centimeter. We're collecting a lot of uh, ash from this volcano. My colleagues in Russia are doing this. And as you can see, the communities and villages are covered. The cars are desperately covered in that. Uh, the snow already was crippling them. Now the ash. This is, of course, in the forest of the Russia. Nothing in the European or the Siberian part. But people have to commute with a poncho wearing it. As I told you that the ash cloud is actually dispersed in that area. Uh, the Bezimiani volcano trapped or my colleagues also in the Volcanology Institute of the Russian Academy of Science. As you can see, the dispersion of this uh, uh, volcanic ash is adding to Bezmiani. The Shivaloch is adding to the Bezmiani and creating the disruption, the air um, traffic in that region in the Pacific Ring of Fire is very active at this moment.